So that's the basics of RGB color. Now, of course, you're asking, how can I make more in different colors? Well, the answer is that we must use more bits per pixel. Let's get rid of the image data we just created and then change the image to be four pixels by four pixels and six bits per pixel. Now, let's try to make a red pixel by turning on just the red light. Since I have six bits per pixel here, that means that I have two bits to set each of the red, green, and blue light. So, that means the amount of red light is now a two-bit setting instead of a single-bit setting like the last time. The largest two-bit number I can make is one, one. So let me try that. Red on, one, one. Green off, zero, zero. Blue off, zero, zero. Hey look, it's our old friend the red pixel. Now comes the fun part. Since the red light of the RGB value has four possible settings, Let's try each of them out and put the pixels next to each other to see the differences. Now, let's add more pixels with different amounts of red. We've got red at 1, 1. Let's do the next one. 1, 0 for red, then zeros for green and blue. Now, how about 0, 1 for red, followed by zeros for green and blue. And finally, 0, 0, 0. Oh. That's just black again. Makes sense. So with a two-bit setting for red, it means I can set the brightness of the red light to four different levels, which are different shades of red. To make more colors, you just continue to mix different intensities of red, green, and blue light. Why don't you try some color mixes? Six bits per pixel. Can you make your favorite color?